Hey guys, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to talk about how to connect to the Wi-Fi after you have installed Arch Linux. So if I type IP ADDR, you can see Arch Linux actually detected my Wi-Fi card is the one WLP0S. But if I do ping google.com, it will fail. So it means that either I haven't installed the appropriate packages which is in this case network manager or I haven't enabled the network manager. To verify it, I can do sudo systemctl start network manager and n and m in this case should be uppercase. If you got such an error that the network manager service is not found, meaning that you haven't installed the network manager. To resolve this issue, we have to go back all the way to the Arch Linux installer and try to install Network Manager using packstrap command. So we don't need to reinstall everything. We just have to go back, boot it from the USB stick, install this package, and then reboot it again and continue from there. But if you don't get any error and you just receive an empty prompt, meaning that your Network Manager is started so you can skip the next section and go to the section afterwards which is about enabling the network manager and connecting to the Wi-Fi from the terminal so in my case since I get the network manager not found I have to actually go back to the installation and then try to install the package so let's do that I'm going to skip these few steps on setting up my Wi-Fi, etc., from the Arch Linux installer. In this case, in the case that you don't know, watch the video on the top right corner how to connect to the Wi-Fi from Arch Linux installer, meaning that when you are trying to install your Arch Linux. So see you in a few seconds. Now I am in the Arch Linux installer medium, and the next step is to mount the Arch Linux hard drive and install the network manager via packstrap so to identify which hard drive to mount i have to do fdisk l and here there are two volumes the first volume is the arch Linux installer in my case so i can do mount slash dev sda1 slash mnt and i can inspect the mnt my files are there now what I have to do is to type packstrap dash capital K slash MNT and then do network manager all in the lower case. So now it's pulling the network manager package from the internet and it's going to install on my Arch Linux installation. That took a while but now installation is finished. So now what I have to do is to reboot and boot the Arch Linux and afterwards I have to set up the network manager. All right, now I am in my Arch Linux and if I do ping google.com, still it fails. But now I have the network manager so I should be able to start the network manager. sudo systemctl start network manager. Again, mind the case sensitivity here. And now what I can do is to enable it for the subsequent uh, booting of the system. So sudo systemctl enable network manager. And I can do also get the status of it. So everything looks fine. If I do more, you can see it's showing is enabled and it is also running. Still, if I do ping google.com, it doesn't work because we haven't connected to a Wi-Fi endpoint yet. So for that one, just type NMTUI and go to the activator connection. Choose the Wi-Fi that you want to connect. Type your password. I'm going to blur out these parts. So just for the privacy reason and after a few seconds, you should be able to actually connect to your Wi-Fi and be able to reach to the internet. All right, 
So if I now type ping google.com, you can see I am connected to the internet. A few tips and tricks in case NMTUI doesn't show any Wi-Fi networks around you. So what you can do is to type IP ADDR and see whether, first of all, it recognizes your Wi-Fi card or not. If it's not, meaning that the, the driver simply is not there, so you have to figure out how to get the driver, if it's available or not. But if it shows the Wi-Fi card under the IP ADDR output, meaning that your Wi-Fi card is already there and the driver is loaded, but the Wi-Fi kernel module is not loaded. This is going to solve 80% of the cases, but it's not guaranteed. So what you can do is to type sudo mode prop and IWL Wi-Fi. So this is loading the uh, Wi-Fi kernel, kernel module and afterwards do the sudo reboot and see whether it will solve your problem or not. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to the channel. Have a great time. Cheers.